Today's video is brought to you by, well, me, because I bought this damn thing on Amazon for 44 bucks. <laughs> Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to Tech of Tomorrow. Today, I've got an unboxing and first look of a product that I actually bought myself on Amazon because I didn't see it on the reviewers list and I said, hey, this product's under 50 bucks and it looks like a pretty decent gaming mouse. Now, this product is from Rocket. This is their Kova Plus mouse. This thing, like I said, is under 50 bucks. I paid $44 Amazon Prime. Got free shipping. It was here like in two days. Now, when those guys ship it out on Amazon Prime, I pretty much like it quite a bit. They do a good job on shipping. I've bought in a lot of other mice when I got things. You guys have seen like the ones I got from China and stuff, and they come all squished up, cramped up. These guys take time to package it up nicely and make sure that I can get it for you folks for a good unboxing. So I'm going to take my little trusty knife. Make a slit right there on the side. And we shall pull this out, and then we shall throw this at the cameraman. Now, here it is. The Rocket. This is the Kova Plus. A lot of things are on it. 3200 DPI. Easy shift. V-shape macros. Now, these guys say V-shape because they say it's basically for a left-handed or right-handed person. I know some people out there say they don't like those mice. I don't really know why. It's just a design. It's not that much different than anything else. You can also switch all the colors on this, make it whatever color you want to. Cool stuff. Flip it around, just let you guys see the back of the box. It's actually a pretty cool box design as far as box go. So now I'm gonna get the camera to readjust and let's hop over the table and let's see what's actually inside of this bad boy. All right, folks, so you guys already saw the box kind of, so we won't really go too much over and iterate. This thing has nine programmable buttons on it though. I will get and uh, open the flap right here. You guys can see inside. Has all the different stuff, but the program buttons over here. So let's see how we get this bad boy out of the box though. So how does it unbox? Every time I get headphones or I get mice, there's always something just a little bit different about how they unbox. So here we go up here. Got a couple little incisions to make. Pop that open, pop the top open. All right then, so we'll get the box out of the way. Inside. All this stuff that's inside right here. What all is in here? So we basically get a credit card this has a number on the bottom. I'm going to cover some of the numbers. You can't see them. This is how you register your product and everything. It's like a little credit card. It's kind of cool. Quick installation guide. The Rocket Kova Plus driver and Rocket stuff. So this actually has a driver. And this right here. I've turned the computer on actually over here behind me. I currently have a mouse hooked up. But I'm going to remove this one and I'm going to actually hook up this one and show you folks how it works here. So kind of mixing things up a little bit here. Let me unplug the old mouse and get ready for this one. So the back here I'm just going to push out now. Looks like this whole plastic piece is going to come apart. All right, now we're going to pull the mouse out of its plastic housing. And I will have the cameraman refocus on this area very closely so you guys can get very much close-ups of the product. So here on the side, we have our first set of buttons. Buttons here. Center button. Additional buttons here. It's going to light up over here. Maybe light up in the center as well, and I do believe it lights up here. So we have these two, two on this side, two on this side, two on top, and the scroll button. And this feels pretty comfortable in my hand. It's not actually too big or too small. It's pretty much a very good size. So let's go ahead and let's take it out of the package here, and I will go ahead and plug it into my system. So now that I've plugged it in, you can see it's flickering a bunch of different colors. 
you'll be able to change it and set it to whatever colors you want. All the drivers and everything have already been installed, so it goes from the different colors from red, green, darker green. I like that one. That one looks really cool, I think. Back to some blues. And here's the bottom of the mouse. All right, folks, thanks for watching. I hope you liked the video. If you did, please make sure to hit the like button. Now, for my first impressions, I think this is going to be a really good product. Like I said before, it's under $50. I bought it off Amazon. You might be able to find it for cheaper if you look around. They have sales. It seems to me like, though, it'll fit anybody's hand. It's got a very, very nice rubber surface on it, like some of the newer cases and laptops that are coming out. I really like that a lot. It feels good in the hand. It's comfortable. I don't think that even if I use this thing for a long time, it's going to be you know, making my hand sore whatsoever. I like the fact that you can change all the lights. Once you install the driver software, you can custom program the buttons to do whatever you want and whatever games you want. Now, like they said, they had nine programmable buttons, so you have two, four, six. I don't know where they're actually getting a total of nine buttons on here, but uh, that'll be seen when I go ahead and install the software. I think from first impressions that for under $50, I think that Rockat has a very solid product in the way of this Kova Plus. We'll see you back here on Tekka tomorrow as I use this mouse in some gaming. Peace.